Traveling across India can be quite an experience, particularly if you're in the blue city of Jodhpur. Right from houses and shops to religious temples, this town is drenched in shades of blue. There's steel, navy blue, royal blue, sky blue, you name it. All of which blend in to give the city its name. I have never seen so many rich textures from up close. It's easy to get lost in a surreal trance as you walk along these narrow alleyways. According to a theory, Jodhpur was painted blue by the Brahmins, India's priestly castes, many centuries ago to distinguish themselves from the others in the hierarchy. However, it's also believed that blue color has a cooling effect which helps people cope with the scorching desert heat. It's just alleyway after alleyway here. Interestingly, almost every home here has its door painted in green. There's a green door, there's another green door, and another one, and another. And check this out, a whole array of green windows. What truly brings the city to life are these spectacular wall paintings. They are amazingly artistic. Painted in bright and saturated colors, these illustrations are a mashup of visual motifs from the rich Rajasthani culture and history. There are images of Rajasthani women draped in radiant saris, men donning the huge turbans, murals advocating a noble cause, creative designs and depictions of ancient royals. So here's another wall painting of a king on a chariot being carried in what looks like a royal procession. Illustrations of deities from Hindu epics such as Ramayana are also conspicuous. I think it's a scene from Ramayana, which is a Sanskrit epic of ancient India. For all its reputation as the blue city though, Jodhpur is moving away from blue. It used to be completely blue until recently. But now, people have opted to add shades of yellow, pink, indigo to their homes. So if you see from above, there are only smatterings of blue houses all over the place. But the city looked something like this not long ago. So there's a blue wall there, there's a yellow, there's an indigo and there's a pink. A pretty colourful neighbourhood. As you walk deeper along these winding roads, you could also bump into these blue stairs. Very identical to those in Chefchouan, Morocco, which is also a blue city. Spotted another blue home with a green door right behind me. Unlike most of the other doors I saw, this one is more rusty and worn off. But look right next to it. The walls painted in a red hue, but the window stays green. This particular blue house here is up for sale. If any of you wants to live in a blue house, then here's a chance. Traversing through Jodhpur is an experience unto itself. It's mesmerizing and impossibly artistic. It soothes and delights anyone that beholds it.